What's up guys? Welcome back. It has been a very, very solid minute. <clears throat> Sorry about that. So, I broke my camera, which is actually my phone, my old phone. And uh, I'll show you. So I've been able to take videos. I've been able to take half-assed pictures, put them on Instagram only because of, you know, filters. Fiddle focus. Anyway. Broke the camera. I got the new Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus, so you're seeing a much wider frame, which is awesome. I'm kind of playing with some stuff. It's either going to turn out really awesome or it's going to turn out like dog shit. But anyway, let's jump into it. Uh, I am overdue. I need to catch you guys up on the dually and the, the progress. Just, I mean, the obvious. This big behemoth right here. Uh, as you guys saw in the intro, I was taking off the factory lights there. And I was going to, we, we just got this plow on. I'm going to jump into that here in just a second. But I was really hoping to drive this last night. But our headlights are less than subpar on that. And my fog lights are great, but the, pl the blade doesn't go high enough. And then my lovely FU lights, as I call them in there, they don't do me any good. So I got creative. So right there's the plug-in for the off-road lights on the brush guard. So what I did was I just made another connector. That way I could switch back and forth as I remove the plow. Now, this is a Western Ultramount. Tell you what, the focus like this does not work very well. But it's a Western Ultramount. I'm going to switch the focus here on you. Alright. So we got a Western Ultramount hiding, or sorry, the plow itself is a Unimount. I got an Ultramount uh, bracket attached to the truck. And then we have a Western Unimount to Ultramount adapter. We got a brand new cutting edge on the front. And I don't know if you can see it, but we got our brand new back drag in there too. And honestly, I'm looking forward to this winter. Now, I'm not doing this to make money. This is strictly for my property my parents and my mother-in-law then you'll understand why later as we go because what kind of youtuber would i be if i wasn't that douchebag that made a plowing video everybody knows how to plow snow but it's cool to watch at least i think it is uh the other reason i haven't caught you guys up is my shop let's go back to wide mode for this my shop isn't, what's up baby? She's going away here shortly. My shop is an absolute disaster. It's destroyed. We got the bed inside, thanks to Bogoma and Luke. I got the old snow dog off of the truck. That's gonna be going up for sale here shortly. And there's just, I mean, it's, it's a freaking mess. I'm not complaining. The guys came in here and they helped me knock this shit out in a weekend okay with the the help and support from luke um and and bogoma is just ridiculous amount of knowledge on these things 
we were able to get it done. And again, the, the love and support from them guys is unreal. But since our shop is an absolute disaster, I put together a toolbox, got everything set up. Thanks, Dad. You know who I'm talking about. Uh, we decided, well, I decided I'm just going to work out of the back of this thing because my barn's a freaking mess. I did have to get the sisters out, the DeWalt's there, but ain't no thing. But anyway, uh, like I said, just wanted to do a quick little uh, update video for you guys. We got the blade on the dually. I got mud flaps down there. Got them quad star lights looking killer as always. Got the back mud flaps in. Um, I did not get a chance to get this on video, but I got the rear shocks in, the diff cover painted up, flush those fluids. Um, this truck is on a, is on a leveling kit. And let's see. I think that's pretty much it. I've done some interior stuff. Uh, I got the home link in there. And then I've got the um, heads up display from a uh, S10 Blazer, which I have showed you guys that before. We got the upgraded steering wheel, the, the shifter there, I and those, those gauge needles. I know I hit on it a lot. But I absolutely love the way that those things turned out. So, anyway, that's just me. But the heads-up display unit, I have not, uh, I haven't wired in any of that yet. So, I'm going to do a video on that. But anyway, uh, that's all that I got for you guys. Um, I am going to throw a clip in here. We're going to test out the light bar and see how it works or how well it doesn't work. I used 4-inch uh, exhaust hangers to hold it up because this is temporary so and not only that but you know bias plies and zip ties you ain't got shit on that i'll just play it but uh yeah that's our update video on the dually so i got plenty more of this stuff coming at you here as as time goes on especially now that i can uh record it again but anyway hit that like button that subscribe button hit the little, uh, little notification bell we are one subscriber away from 100 so <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, again, the love and support. I appreciate it as always, guys. Uh, take care. We'll see you on the next one.